at least once a year, I like to bring in some of my world famous homemade donuts. The trick is to undercook the icing and everyone gets to know each other in the box. <laughs> Everyone loves my homemade donuts, no, no. and it's probably the thing I do best. No! I'm a good student, you know. I'm usually never late for a class except when there's, you know, five terrible things that go wrong for me. Oh, come on, I can't deal with this right now. It, it, it's not scanning. Dude, try another angle. I have tried every single possible angle. People that walk slowly in hallways deserve to be suspended. I mean, I have places to be, things to do. I mean, is it that hard to walk on two legs? Oh, come on, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me, pardon Sorry. me, single guy, single guy coming through. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Can you believe the audacity of some people, like the audacity? Oh, this can't be happening. Oh, come on. Mahogany and scarlet and seafoam green and lavender and then, then there's my favorite pen. I love, love, love this pen. You. What's your favorite pen? You got it wrong one. Oh. 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 What are you doing? Having lunch! So where are we going? Uh, we can go to McDonald's or Wendy's or Panera or Taco Bell or Moe's or we, there's so many different places we could go or we could go to Friendly's. I love Friendly's. You know, like everything's like so happy there. They have so many fun ice cream flavors and sometimes even have a clown and oh, I want to go to Friendly's. Yeah, yeah. Oh. All right, so I got a Lunchable and Smart Water, because I'm smart. I got lemon juice because I'm sour. Oh, well, what'd you get to eat? And? Oh. I love Lunchables. No eating in my car. Oh my God. God I can't believe this happened. I don't even go here. Shakespeare's Sonnet 116 has an extended metaphor throughout, um, which is related to Malak. seafaring. Malak. Yeah. What? May is the laboratory. Can you just let me finish this? Um, so, so it is a... I really need to go. Okay, sure. Go ahead, go. Take the pass. It is an ever-fixed mark. Take the pass. 
pa the, the pass. You didn't take the pass. <sighs> Listen, dude, I'm not even gonna lie to you, I'm 100% not going to the bathroom. I guess it's time to head back to class now. About the loss of his vision, and seriously, Zach, you're three blocks late. Uh, whatever, bro. Time is just a social <laughs> construct. Oh, uh, well, that may be true, and that could be a discussion for another day in physics, but we're not studying string theory, it's Renaissance poetry. So, I'll count you early for tomorrow, but for today, you're really late, so you gotta go. Bye-bye. Uh, Mr. Johnson, I like to call him Mr. J. Uh, he's really not a creepy guy. I mean, we had a different teacher at one point, uh, but he kind of just like left and never came back. Um, yeah, he's he's been there ever since. Uh, never left. I, I think he's just lonely. Oh, Mr. Zach, welcome to class. It's been uh, 30 minutes already. You know the only way to make this up? Come on, brother. Come on. Embrace me. Nah. Come on. I'm good. What, brothers? I am good. Let's Thank go. <laughs> all right. Take a rain check on that, all right, buddy? <clears throat> okay, class. Let's dive and see what riveting topic we're going to learn about today. I wrote down about Syria. What's going on there is just absurd. Yeah, I wrote down legalization. Legalization of what? You know, don't worry about it, dude. I put down woman suffrage. It's so important to learn about the woman of our past. Okay. Today we're going to learn about the Salem Witch Trials. We're going to learn about me today instead. Um, excuse me, that's not in the curriculum. Uh, I don't know. I'll, I'll guess we're over with the paper, Fed. Oh boy, here we go again. She left me, man. You know, we were dating for three weeks, okay? I thought that was enough to get married. I thought so. But she didn't think so. I mean, she loved me for a freaking janitor. Mr. Johnson, I know how you feel. No talking, I'm talking! So sometimes class can be a bit of a downer, but um, other times, we like to make it pretty special. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Teacher Matchmaker! <laughs> Our contestant here today is Mr. Johnson. Mr. Johnson, how are you feeling today? I'm feeling great. Alright, well that's good to hear. Let's bring out the contestants! Now, contestant number one likes long walks on the beach is known as a pretty woman and has a knack for spaghetti and meatballs. Let's hear it for contestant number one. <laughs> uh, Mr. Johnson, are you considering which contestant you're going to pick now? Uh, I don't know. I, there's so many choices. Which one should I Which pick? one should you pick, ladies and gentlemen? Contestant number one! Contestant number one! You chose... Julia Roberts! Oh my god, Julia Roberts! I love Julia Roberts! All right, Mr. Johnson, just calm down, calm down. Now you, I just want you to go out there and find your own Julia Roberts. All right, I will, thank you. All right, class, that's the bell, so uh, I'll smile you later.
on location in a parking lot. I'm standing in a parking space. Gotta hope I don't get run over by a car. Oh, it's okay. Oh, That's a wrap. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Oh, you gotta keep walking this way, though. How was I supposed to know to not go to Hibachi on Tuesday, okay? That's their worst night. Hey, you got it. You're kidding me. Whoa, yes, good, good, good. I have no idea what just happened. We just want to talk to you guys about what really went into this show or video that we made, like how it came to be, how we made what, it, how we made it, and like you know everything about it. So, um, how did it all start? It all started. Me and Maggie working together. Mrs. T says we can make any video we want, any video possible. Yes. And so... We have no ideas. We had zero ideas. None. None came to mind. And, and then, then yeah. Then she said, um, she you want said, to say what you said? Yeah. She said, uh, do the project I've always said no to. And instantly we were like, okay, well now Well, we it's wanna, a mockumentary. I've, like, for years people have wanted to make, like, some kind of, like, yeah. office mockumentary parody type thing. It's always been, like, the dream project for It's been the dream class. project. And so we saw a lot of other classes or a lot of high schools make their own like mockumentary yeah, based on their I own high school. I watched so many other schools. Like, so yeah, so we took the initiative to be like, okay, well, we can do that, and thus yeah. started classes in blank. <laughs> classes in blank. We didn't find a working title. We didn't find the name for the show for a while, but yeah. uh, it was a couple days. After we finally had our idea down, we went right into script writing, which took about, what, three weeks? Yeah, yeah, like two to three weeks. Like, all the details in, this... the, in the video that you guys will see is, like, we planned it out meticulously. Like We went into detail. Yeah, it was uh, a ten-page script. This beauty. This yeah. beauty is ten pages. A lot of stuff on it. Yeah. It took us probably, like, the first scene is with Brandon Vita, and that scene probably took us two days to write just because we yeah. really wanted to make sure that everything would work out perfectly. It took about 20 minutes to film. It, it was probably <laughs> it the fastest like thing we that. had to shoot. But that, that was well, the, that's because he's that, a pro. Yeah, it was Brandon, Brandon's a Brandon, pro. Shout out to Brandon Vita. And uh, it was just great yeah. um, because we already had everything planned and ready. Yeah. But um, yeah, it took us a while to write through the script. Um, but I think, I think it was going good. so detailed in the script was beneficial. Cause yeah. Then it went like that, filming everything. Oh yeah, and then filming, filming was pretty fun because um, that was rough because we had a lot of like scheduling difficulties. It, oh, yeah. The hardest part of this video was like just getting all the right people we needed at the right time. Which yes, was later impossible. was a problem for the yeah. classroom scene. But the first couple of scenes was yeah. like everything worked, worked like well. It went really, really well. well. The first like week and a half, we got everything done but the classroom scene. The classroom scene. <laughs> Took possibly like an extra two weeks just yeah. because we could not get all the characters that we filmed. needed. Yeah. And we couldn't get the space we needed and yeah. everything. That was a lot of work. It was fun. Just though. to get it together. It was all great. Yeah. And there was um, a point in time where we were going to cut the classroom scene entirely. It got rough. But yeah. it, it came together. We, like, the last possible day we shot yes. it, we got it done. It yeah. came out better than we, I think we expected. And um, yeah. it was good. A lot of funny things went into filming, though. We <laughs> had, like, a lot of. Weird experiences. Oh. Shout out to Mrs. Thomas. She was there for Brandon oh, yeah. the cold. She was so great. Recording. Love that. Yeah, that was that was so cold. Um, uh, personal favorite is personal when, favorite story. Yeah, we were shooting the all the B roll for the opening part, um, like the actual like song and the credits in the beginning, and we went into the library and Miss Russ's creative writing class, our advanced creative writing class. Yeah, the, one of her classes was in there. And we were like, hey, can we just like film you guys real quick? Just, you know, some classic 
class B roll. And she was like, yeah, um, do you want like me to teach? And we were like, no, it's fine, you can do whatever you want. She's like, I think I'll, I'll, I'll teach. And so on this whiteboard behind her, or whatever it is, she pulled up a Wikipedia on, was it potato salad? I think it was potato salad. I believe it was potato salad. And then started teaching her class about potato salad. We put it in the credits or in the intro for like, for probably like two seconds. Yeah. But she went on for probably a minute. Yeah, she was, they were asking questions. Yes. She was giving plenty of information. It, it was, was hilarious. It was my favorite thing. And then we also threw, I think my favorite was probably when Sierra threw the, she had like Sierra or Marissa had Sierra's lunch throughout the window and then a piece of bologna from the Lunchables got stuck on like her car. That yeah. was funny too. You can That's hear the, the bologna hit the car. Yeah. You, it makes this sound. But after filming, after all those funny times, we went right into editing yeah. and that was like, I mean, that was probably a breeze for me. Maggie probably had the <laughs> Hardest part so, about that? I originally knew that I was going to be, like, I we wanted the Parks and Education, Parks and Recreation. Yeah, Parks and Recreation, <laughs> jeez. The Parks and Recreation opening with, like, you know, the moving stuff. And so I knew that I was going to try and do that. And so Robbie started um, editing all of, like, the scenes and stuff. And I started editing that. Robbie edited everything but Brandon's scene while I edited the opening yeah it took me as long as to ed I edit all those scenes as it took Maggie, Maggie to finish the opening but the opening had a lot of moving oh, parts it was yeah. really complicated it was and my like, baby before that even we we were arguing for like like days just on like what song to pick we listened to oh, so yeah. many remixes and yeah, everything I thought we and we were wanted our own remix song of, that like, was the, the main office thing intro to do. I thought we were gonna do a remix and we found a song that we liked and it, it fit perfectly oh, and uh it's such a bop it's yeah. called Snooky. <laughs> Which I think is the best part. Such a bop. <laughs> it's a bop. All right. Well, bottom line is um, a lot of work. A lot, a lot of work. A lot of work. This video. Yeah. So uh, we really, really hope that you guys enjoy it. So. Yeah.